just sitting here thinking about life. Looking at my cards. When I woke up, <laughs> I got the sun card. Lots of happiness and joy. I feel like I've come out from under a rock. <laughs> it's crazy today. Yes, I've had a little problem with my eye. A sty in my eye. But it's going away and I hope I can show my face soon. So I will be making more videos and live videos, but at the moment I had a feeling a little bit earlier that someone out there needs something, needs some help. So I thought I would do a little reading for that person. I'm sensing blue. Someone's wearing blue. Okay, I'm feeling they might enjoy an angel card. Let me do a little prayer first. I ask for the spirit of light and loves protection. I pray to invoke our guides and divine angels today for healing energy for our group. Please tell us what we need to hear. Heal us with your light of love. Help us spread all that is good for us in the world. Together we say amen. Okay, and every day when I look at my table, I have different areas of my home where I have set up little altars, and I love having this card up. No need to worry. Do we have to worry? No, give it to God. Let it go, whatever you're worrying about. Okay, let me pull an angel. for our friend in blue, someone wearing blue. Okay. All right. The angel cards are amazing. It's like they're shining up toward heaven or down from heaven, another realm, the Titanian Rainbow Quartz is what we're getting here. These are crystal angel cards. Okay. Multifaceted, this person in blue is multifaceted. Uh, there are many layers and dimensions to the situation. So it's not an easy thing. It's uh, complicated. Life is complicated, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to pull the lapis. and my angel light for intuition to find out what this person needs. Okay. 
have my little cup here. Spring makes me smile. Okay. All right. Leave that angel card upright. And another card I like to leave up is the Sword of Truth, the Ace of Swords. Okay. All right. And that was, in fact, the card I just got. So, the truth. The truth is coming out. That is telling me that this person in blue... This person is feeling like they've been duped. They're seeing something clearly. There's an influence over them. The Queen of Swords. The Queen sees through lies. And she can just carve away what does not serve her. If people are bringing up ideas, she doesn't have to take them in. So the person in blue is being influenced by the queen. They're starting to see the truth. I'm seeing political truth, but this can be any truth. People get lied to all the time, but thank goodness most people are honest. Okay, the magician. So what this person needs to do is, and this is a perfect time to do it with the moon in Pisces, the magician. It means that you manifest, you Think about what you really, really, really want in life. And you do a manifestation. You do an imagination. You close your eyes. You tense every muscle in your body. And then relax every muscle in your body. Do anything that makes you feel more relaxed. Wipe every thought out of your mind. Let things just flow in. Things that seem to be outside of yourself. They're really within, but let, let something come in. What is it you first see? What is it you want to manifest in your life? What do you really, truly want? Now, if you don't know, every day for a month, write down three things that you want. Don't look back until the end of each week. By the end of the month, what you desire will be crystal clear. Manifested it will be. Until next time.